Michael Lean, and this is another Bristlecone broadcast. Today we're going to be continuing our series on our expertise in Power BI migrations. Most of our clients, and over 90% of the Fortune 500, are migrating to Power BI. They find it gives them a lower total cost of ownership and incredible value, which is realized in a pretty short amount of time. With Bristlecone, we're able to get companies spun up on Power BI in a relatively short amount of time. We do this through a combination of things, process, people, and proprietary AI accelerators. Today, I have Dushyant Kumar, who heads our BI practice at Bristlecone. He has over two decades of experience working with the top companies in the world, and he's going to share his expertise today. Uh, we will be drilling down, actually, into one specific use case of ours with a global edtech company, and they successfully navigated the Power BI migration journey with our help. So, Dushyant, welcome. Thank you for joining me. Hey, Michael. So let me ask you, um, tell me about this engagement and what we did, and specifically, why did they choose us to help them? Yeah. Uh, so this ad tech firm, they approached us for one of their use case, or it was specific to a Lipton SIP migration related to Tableau, where they were able to make their mind that they'll try to move all their dashboards around 150 or say 200 dashboard from Tableau to Power BI. And they were looking for some automated route for this because they were struggling with the timeline. So they had that kind of tight timeline to surrender their Tableau licenses, and they were looking for a partner who can do it quickly. And that's where uh, most of the kind of vendors, they approached them to do it manually, which was more of a risk for them. And that's where we came into picture, and we proposed our proprietary solution, which is Tableau to Power BI framework for such migration. And we just kind of covered a few demos with them. And this is going to cover report rationalization, migrating it from Tableau to Power BI with the automated approach, which is going to use two to three accelerators, which were made use of uh, typical cutting edge Gen AI technology, some of the AI solution, or our Bristlecone AI ML engine, which is making it a complete solution for such migration. So we used it and we were able to meet their timelines. Huh? Specifically, okay. it, was, it was just for the 200 dashboard and they, this customer is really, I'll, I'll call it a delighted customer. They are really happy with our services. Huh? And now it seems that uh, speed is probably the most critical factor. They realized they couldn't do it themselves. They went to other vendors who quoted some very long timelines, and it seems like we can do it the fastest. So can you dig into that a little deeper? Why why are we faster? Uh, good question, in fact. And, and that's velocity and speed has been uh, the key here, or I'll say game changer. So there are three elements. One, we have a component, we call it report rationalization framework, which is going to read all your reports and we'll be able to inform it to client like out of 200, 10 or 20 reports are duplicate or useless. You can just eliminate them. Second category is going to be how many standard reports which you need to retain will give you a pure list of reports which should be part of your landscape. Third category is more about, we call it BI modernization. There are reports where we need to modernize it or simplify it. So our framework, report rationalization, is going to focus more on that, where we add value, because all your unused reports will, will be eliminated, and that is eventually going to save or have impact on your course. So that was one area. After this, there are two more, I'll say game changer player. One is, we call it a Bistlecon, a kind of data model converter that is going to convert your Tableau model into Power BI automatically. And that is blazing fast. It does work. It is more of a seconds work for this. You just push your Tableau app and you'll get your Power BI data model within seconds. So that's one where we'll be able to save kind of 60% of your effort. Mm. Second is uh, when you are done with your model, you just need to kind of drag and drop your chart. But business rule or formula conversion is still a challenge. So for this, we have a we call it Bistlecon AI ML engine, which is going to convert all your formulas or business rule automatically from the Tableau to Power BI or any target or any destination code which you can choose. It is going to do it within a second. So our seasoned team or seasoned BI migration expert will just copy that code. They'll put it into Power BI 
and and they'll validate it and we are going live and that's what we did at edutech firm that's how they went live about it within weeks so Dushyant, that sounds wonderful you mentioned 60 percent faster you mentioned that they're delighted with the work that we did incredible but can you mention some other hard numbers now that you've seen this engagement go live and they're they're getting use out of this what other success factors have you seen come into play with this edtech company Michael, for the 150 plus report, uh, we were able to kind of brought that automation in the game, right? Just to kind of reduce their efforts by 50% and using 60% automation because Tableau to Power BI framework was getting used with our seasoned report factory approach, right? So we have a seasoned migration team who is going to target data model, UI, UAT. So there are different ports will, which will come into such engagement. So there'll be a different port or team which will try to convert all those models quickly. Then there'll be a team who is just going to do the business rule. They'll quickly write all those codes with, within weeks or days to convert it. And then there'll be a team which will handle the UAT or unit testing. That's how we go about it. So there are different people. We have a seasoned BI migration team, which is really able to do it quickly within months, within weeks. Wh whichever customer is this, they came to us for a Lipton SIP migration. They just say, hey, we have a tight timeline. We need to surrender our Tableau license, and we were able to meet it. Yeah. So team is really going to be kind of one of the key player here in such migration, which we have. Wonderful. And what about life after the migration? What's what's Have you heard about any changes that have happened? how they're able to interact with leadership, get insights. What are some of the things that you've heard? I think the first one is, of course, they were uh, there was positive impact on their TCO. So they were able to make save good money, I would say, yeah? in terms of licensing cost. There was no additional or unused ETL activity because we have eliminated all that. Right? And at the same time, performance matter a lot. So we were able to optimize some of these dashboards for them. So they're, they're really enjoying all these dashboards, which we have migrated for them. So, so their users are happy. Business community is kind of delighted. That's what I can summarize about this project. Well, wonderful. Give us a, you know, a short three pointers for somebody considering this journey for themselves. What advice would you give? Ah, uh, and Michael, this emergence of Microsoft Power BI has changed things a lot, especially in the BI area. You know that there are kind of frequent changes happening in the Gartner's kind of mm -hmm. BI leader quadrant, and and Power BI has been a number one tool there. And that's where more and more customers, they are going towards Power BI. We came up with this framework and that is making customers life easy, right? Using this framework, they can do it quickly. So any customer who is thinking to move towards Power BI to have positive impact on TCO, they can just think about our Tableau to Power BI framework. That is going to save their cost. There will be positive impact on TCO. There will be optimized report, and, and we'll mm -hmm. do it blazing fast. This will be within weeks as, as compared to manual efforts, which mm -hmm. other vendors are doing. So I don't think there are too many vendors who are using such migration framework in the industry. So we are a bit unique in that sense. It seems like, you know, if somebody's considering this, they really need to go with a vendor that have these have these frameworks really thought out um, and well architected. So that's wonderful to hear. I will mention that this is a probably the second or third video we've done on this Power BI migration. And you can see our case studies, you can see other videos by going to our website, bristlecone.com. Dishyan, I want to thank you for being on here and, and sharing a little bit about your experience, your expertise. Uh, hopefully, you know, if you're watching this at home, you find this helpful. If you want to talk to Dishyan, we don't just keep him secret. He can talk to you. Just reach out to us. We'll coordinate a meeting. And again, we do a lot of this up front because we understand that this may be the first time that you're hearing about Bristlecone. We really want to build that trust with you. So we're more than happy to give upfront conversations to help you navigate your own journey. So again, I want to thank you for tuning in to this newest episode of the Bristlecone broadcast. I'm Michael Lean, and I thank you very much.